Hi everybody, I am coming to you with number 70. Uh, yeah, and this comes to us from, I'm sorry, Molly Pate. I'm listening to the bird talking, so that kind of distracted me, but she she's talking up a storm tonight, so, and whistling really odd. <laughs> so this, yes, this comes to us from Molly Pate in Alabama. So let's go ahead and get this open. I went ahead and kind of took it out of the package. Oops. There we go. Let's get the card opened up here. Okay. You're special to me and you're on my mind today. Okay. Uh, she says, I'm praying for you to get well soon. And yeah, I had, I had pneumonia really bad for six weeks. And then my mom fell, broke her leg in several places. My dad got pneumonia. So it's just been ongoing. And I apologize for the bird, guys. <laughs> but she's on a roll right now. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, this is from Molly. And let's see what she has here. Um, so I have, ooh, I've got some beautiful bling that I can use for shaker cards. I have some flags, a blue turquoise pin, love turquoise, um, some straws that I can make wands with. Ooh, I like this one with the butterflies on it. And uh, some really pretty colored pen pencils. So yeah, and oh my goodness, wait a minute, there's more in here. Uh, there is, oh, it's a swan. <gasps> Molly, where did you find the swan? Look, she had little pom-poms in the little swan. Thank you so much, girl. Oh, I love that swan. So stinking cute. Okay, yes, that's the bird ringing. She's, she's making it sound like the phone's ringing. But she's kind of getting on my nerves a little bit right now. <laughs> Shh, angel. Let's see what we have here. This fell out of which one? This one, I think. Yeah, good night. So she put my name up here with this beautiful tassels. Love the tassels. And all of the swans that I'm nuts about. Thank you. She made a beautiful tassel on the side here. I think this is with a, I think, I'm not sure if this is the Dollar Tree one or not. That has a pretty top on that. But she's got a note here, so let's see what her note says. Here we go. So, let's see. It says, hi, Ramona. I hope you're feeling better. Thank you so much for the wonderful giveaway. This is my first pocket letter. It was so much fun. So her name's Molly Pate. She, her birthday's October 25th, 1964. I'm a 1964 girl as well. Uh, she was an elementary school teacher, married 32 years, two kids and two granddaughters, but no channel. So let's see what she did here. I like how she did this. I love this. These little roses from Michaels are so stinking cute. They discontinued them, and I wish that they would have kept them because I use them in all kinds of projects. They had pink and all different colors. This little envelope is so stinking cute that she has right here. Look at this cute little bow that she has on it. Okay, so, ooh, I've got some pretty bling that I've never seen before, so I don't know where she's gotten this stuff, got this stuff from. Look at this bling. It's very pretty. Yeah, I don't know where you got that from, but it's awful pretty. Thank you. Okay. I'm real slow at getting this stuff back in here, guys. I'm sorry. Try to go quick, but oh look, she used a, a different, a different little rose. Love them, and her little, her little envelopes are so cute that she made here. And I love the paper. This paper is really pretty. And she, she gifted me, look, a bunch of little roses and things. So cute. Love those. So pretty. 
Oops. Angel, shh. Yeah, she's talking back at me now. Yeah, you be good. She's telling me to be good. There's a swan. Another swan. Where'd you get this paper? I know, I've probably seen it in the stores and just not bought it. And then she's got these tags. Look at these pretty tags that she made. Very pretty. Thank you so much, girl. And I've got some twine. She's got everything put in here so nice and neat. Oh, look how pretty. She gifted me a bunch of lace. I like this. I like anything that's like not white or cream, right? Because that's what we all see is white and cream. Girl, you did a lot of work on these little baggies. I love my name there on the banners. So cute. Oh, and I've got some beautiful sequins. And look. Some more things I can put in shakers. They're table scatters, but I can put them in shakers. And you hear the bird? She goes, ooh. Yeah, I know, Angel. <laughs> She's laughing at me now. May not be loud enough for you guys to hear, which is a good thing. <laughs> She's my mom's bird. She's not my bird. She does not she doesn't like anybody but my mom. But uh, she's an African gray, and they have the largest vocabulary of any bird out there. Some beautiful tassels from um, Michaels. Shh. Yeah, you be good. Mm, Sophie, go my night. Oh, God. I have washi all over my hands. I can't get it off. Look at all these cute little envelopes. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's see what we have here. Some tags or something. Oh, cute. Look at that. Look how cute those are. I'm thinking I could use this in my um, Gilded Lily book. Yep. That's what I'm going to use it in. My Gilded Lily book. That will go perfect. Thank you, girl. That's perfect. Okay. Last one, guys, and it's a beautiful bag. You did a lot of... Uh, a lot of crafting on these little bags for it to be your first pocket letter, girl. Angel, shh. There's no way I can quiet her down, guys. <laughs> oh my goodness, look how cute. These are little uh, flags. How cute are those? Thank you so much, girl. Okay, girl, I will uh, go ahead and add you in, Molly. Thank you so much for your entry. And uh, yeah, we'll see you at the next one. Hi everybody, I am back with entry number 71 from Amber Bailey in North Carolina. So let's see what she's got here. I think I got it. Yeah, I got it. Oh, look at her cute little... Uh, I think that is a Sizzix die, I think. I'm not 100% sure. But I think it is. Look how cute. Look how cute. That's really cute, Amber. I love that. Oh, and she did. You, you have a swan stamp? Is that a swan stamp? I think that's a swan stamp. Look at all of these vintage. I think these are all vintage stamps that she's got here. Wow, I think they are, guys. So pretty. Okay, so she's got two Ramona. Let's see here. Oh, she even did this vintage. This is like, look at this paper. I don't know if she tea dyed that. 
Uh, it says, Dear Ramona, I had so much fun making this pocket letter. My name is Amber and I'm 36 years old. I'm married to a sweet, helpful, and hardworking man. We have four kids, woo three boys and one girl. We stay pretty busy with sports. I'm a stay-at-home mom. I'm very thankful to be able to do that. I haven't been watching your videos very long. I'm glad I found you. I don't feel good all the time and I spend lots of time in bed. Doctors don't know why my hands hurt and cramp up. My feet go numb and make me not be able to walk. Girl, that's pretty much what I have, but I have it in my entire body and they don't know what it is. Um, uh, so I craft in bed. So do I. That's where I do all my stuff is in bed. Oh my gosh. Your vid videos help me by letting me know what just came out. Uh, then I'm not wasting time looking and walking around. Thank you for all you, all of the videos that you do. Hope you like my pocket letter. It's my first one. Hope you have a wonderful day, your friend Amber. Oh my gosh, how cute. Amber, I'm, I'm right there with you. They don't know what is wrong with me, but mm, yeah, it's, um, I feel, yeah. <laughs> I'm not even going to go into it right now, but yeah, I love this bag. Look at this bag she made. So cute. It's very cute. I'm trying to get it around here. So I think she gave me a bunch of Tim Holtz ephemera. That's cute. Yes, so I have Tim Holtz. I think this is from the Botanicals botanicals and the relatives <gasps> and I have more swans I have two sets of swans in here from um, Hobby Lobby I wish the rest of the stores would jump on the bandwagon because I'm absolutely nuts I can't have enough of these I love them so much and then um, <laughs> these are so stinking cute. I'm not sure she got these from Allie or not, but they look like it. This is so pretty, girl. You did such a good job on this, and she used my initial lip on the top. You did a really good job on layering that and making that look vintage. And look how pretty. This comes from Recollections. What paper line did you use with this? This is so pretty. I think that's a Martha Stewart uh, butterfly. She put my name here and made me a little pinwheel here and a swan stamp here. Oh, so pretty. Yes, I love this paper line that you used here. And you've got some beautiful stamps, girl. You really do. Okay, Amber, thank you so much for your entry. We will get you entered. And uh, hopefully, I'm hoping I can, I can get a lot of these um, taped or filmed and um, get some winners picked here pretty soon. So thank you so much. We'll see you on the next one. Okay, everybody, we are um, at entry number 72 from Catherine in Pennsylvania. Um, I'm writing down the name so that I don't forget. I know Catherine. She was worried that I didn't get her package. So, um, oh my gosh, did she load me down. Goodness gracious. I have a ton of lace here. Look at all this lace I have bias tape oh my goodness girl you loaded me down look at this so much girl look at this pretty lace oh I can't wait to to uh, dye some of this this is like lace that I haven't seen in my area I haven't seen anything like this look how pretty look at all of it Catherine really holy cow look at all of this ooh I can use this in a Twilight album and I have some more bias tape 
Look at all of this. Catherine, you really, really, really loaded me down. All of this. Uh, the, your package was at my next door neighbor's house, who was out of town. So, Angel, shh. Be quiet. Yes, be quiet. I apologize for that, guys. She's. This is really pretty. Oh, my goodness. I don't know where you got all this from. Look at it. Guys, this is beautiful. I know the, the camera does not do this justice. It does not. This is beautiful. Oh, it's so pretty. I can't wait to stain that. Okay. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Look how pretty. Look at all of these. How pretty. I think the only one, the only picture or image that I've seen, I think, is this one. I don't think I've seen any of these other ones before. I don't know where you got those from. I hope, yes, here's your, here's your, uh, your information. Whoop. Uh, she's uh, Catherine Foreman from Pennsylvania. Her favorite color is black. Really? That's the first. I've never heard of anybody's um, favorite color being black. She does not have a YouTube channel, but her sister Janet does. It's RTS Scrapbooking. I think I received an entry from your sister, I believe. This is her first pocket letter, and she hopes I like the lace. If not, feel free to pass it on into one of your other giveaways. No, I like it. <laughs> I will not be passing that on. <laughs> so I have... Lots of bling here, guys. Um, I've got all this. Look at all this bling. And then a button from Hobby Lobby. Beautiful pearls. Um, that from This is uh, Gilded Age from uh, its timeline from Hobby Lobby. And some red buttons that I can use. And my uh, I can use all of this red stuff in my um, Twilight album once I get my friend to go ahead and commit to a date when I, we can start. <laughs> So anyway, thank you so much, Catherine. I will let you know by email that I've received your package. Alrighty, thanks for joining the entry, the the giveaway, and I will go ahead and and put your name into the giveaway. I'm sorry, guys. I'm really tired. I've been running all day, but I've got to do some of this. So <laughs> see you at the next one. Hi, everybody. I am back with entry number 73, and this is from Evie Gonzalez in Puerto Rico. So, let's get started with her entry. I love getting things from different places, because everybody has a different way of kind of crafting if that makes sense, like you can always tell things that are uh, from different places. Ooh, I love these little bags, Evie. I hope I say, I'm saying your name right. I'm trying to get it open. <laughs> it's got a really, really tight knot in here. Oh, oh my God gosh oh look at my swan yeah the bird likes me saying oh look at the swan oh my gosh it is so stinking cute i don't know how you did that so cute but look at these beautiful oh my goodness see they get different things over there than we get over here so pretty Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, one of the rhinestones came off. Okay, I'm going to put it back in the bag so I can glue it back. I know where it came from. I don't want to pull anything out. 
it's so pretty girl look at this look at that oh, cherubs girl no okay so they fit they came off but e6000 will fix it look how pretty I love these thank you so much whoops I love that little bitty frame that is so cute so adorable and then she gifted me some lace it looks like oh she crocheted look she crocheted some little flowers oh thank you so much girl how pretty are those love them oh wow and then look, look at this beautiful lace here that she gifted me. Absolutely beautiful. Very pretty. Thank you so much. I'm not sure if your name is Evie or Evie. I don't know. I hope I'm saying that right. I... Okay. Now for the pocket letter, I believe. She packed it up really well. I have one sitting here from Australia as well that I can't wait. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. Oh, I love it. Oh my goodness. Look how pretty. Oh, that is so pretty. And it looks like she crocheted another little flower here and put it on top. Very pretty. That's gorgeous. Oh, my gosh. I wish we had some of this stuff here, but we don't. This is so pretty. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, I hope you gave me... Uh, did you give me... Yes, you did. She gave me a little letter. I was hoping that she gave me something. Look at this cute little shaker. Look at that. How cute and how delicate. Oh, I love all of these. These are beautiful. And all my colors. Look at this beautiful dangle that she made here. So pretty. Oh, this is so gorgeous. I love this. And some, I've got some, uh, some lace here, some beautiful cabochons here, some more lace here, some appliques, some little doodads here that are really, really, really pretty. I've got two crowns here. Look at this. So vintage. I mean, it's so vintage. Look how pretty. Look how pretty those are. I love these. This is right up my alley. I just, I love this kind of stuff. Look how pretty. See how pretty? Very, very, very pretty. Okay, let's see here. Um, letter she packed it all packed it all up really pretty even with a cute little look at this how adorable it's like a little book it is a book oh my goodness it's a book hello Ramona my name is Evie and I am from Puerto Rico I'm still not sure if I'm saying your name right my birthday is on June the 1st happy belated birthday I'm so happy that I was able to make your pocket letter and glad that I will be sending it to you in time for your birthday challenge. Watching all the different entries inspired me to push myself to make one. I hope you like it and that you enjoy the extra little gifts. I love them. Um, thanks for all the videos. 
um, she's basically saying happy birthday and thanks. Uh, uh, love you, sweetie. Thank you so much. Let's see. Um, I was trying to see if she has uh, a YouTube. Her YouTube channel is Evie. Yes. So, ooh, I hope I'm saying this right. Her, like her last name's Gonzalez, but that's not her YouTube name. I'm going to have to go ahead and look that up because I'm having trouble. It looks like uh, T-U-R-Q-U-I... C G A O T. That's probably wrong, but I will go ahead and look that up. Um, and because it's written real small, I'm having trouble uh, reading it. So anyway, yes, she does post things on uh, YouTube a lot. So um, yeah, guys, go check her channel out. And thank you so much. I love every little bit of this. This is so stinking cute. Thank you, and we'll see you at the next one. Okay, everybody, we are back with entry number 74 from Norway. So I kind of just cut the bubble wrap open. Oh, look how pretty. Oh, my goodness. Look how pretty. Ooh, I love this little spray. She made a stick pen. So she's got a pocket letter holder. Look how pretty. Oh, so stinking pretty, girl. Oh, my goodness. Oh, it's the Fairy Bell Collection by Prima. Oh, I can't believe you cut this piece of paper up like this. Because I love Fairy Bell. Um, Tina um, had uh, um, one of the channels. She did, I think it was Mint Green at Crafty Bean. It's Tina at Crafty Bean. Um, I think she did a Fairy Bell, but I think it was Mint Green. Oh, my goodness. Oh, gosh. I hope you gave me, did you give me some information? Yes. Yay. Oh, how pretty. Okay. Let's see here. It's look how pretty that is. So she's got two sheets here that are, she's got stuff written on. I'm not sure how much she wants me to share. Uh, to Ramona, happy birthday. Hope you're having a great celebration and I'm really happy to join your challenge. Hugs. And I'm not sure how she says her name either. She's, uh, I think it's Trine Lease. It's T-R-I-N-E dash L-I-S-E at Creative T-L. Oh my gosh, yes. Yeah. So her YouTube channel is Creative T-L. Her blog is My Little Creative Place, blogspot.com. And she is from... Uh, Arns, Norway. I know I'm probably not saying that right. I'm not good with stuff like that. But anyway, oh my goodness. Trying, I love all of these. Look how pretty all of this is. So stinking pretty. And she gave me some lace here. Dream, create, inspire. I've got some little tags here. Look at all these little bitty tags that she has in here. So cute. I love this fairy bell collection though. Um, yeah, so very pretty. Thank you so much, Trine. I really do appreciate you uh, joining the challenge. Like I said, I love, love, love getting things from uh, other countries and places. It is just so inspiring to me to see what you guys can create. But this is, I can't believe you cut this piece of paper up because it's so doggone pretty. But thank you so much. I will go ahead and add you in to the giveaway and I will treasure this forever. Thank you so much, Trying. Bye-bye. 
Okay, everybody, I am back with entry number 75, and this comes from Laura. I'm not sure if she wants me to share her last name yet or not, but we will find out, and she's from New York, I believe. Uh-huh. So, let's see what she has. Oh, my goodness. Girl, what did you do? Holy cow. So, I have a bracelet. Oh my goodness. Oh, look how pretty. So pretty. You know, she said that um, her package um, was actually sitting at my neighbor's house along with someone else's. Look how pretty that is. So pretty. Is that an Anna Griffin or is this a... I know I saw some of these on Alley, but Anna Griffin has some as well that I bought. Um, yeah, uh, her package has been sitting at my neighbor's house. My neighbor has been up in Oklahoma. And look at all these cute little things she sent. Oh, my gosh. So, anyway, my neighbor came back today. And I've been busy with my parents in the, na in the, the hospital. So, um... Yeah, so Laura, here's your package. Gosh, you gave me all kinds of stuff. Jeez. And I've got a foam flower. Look how pretty. All kinds of flowers. Look at all these good goodies. Beautiful colors. Love these colors. Mm, they're so pretty. Look at these. This is stuff like I haven't seen before. I haven't seen, I don't know if she, cro did you crochet these? Because there's an awful lot of them. Ooh, this is pretty too. Where did you get this, girl? That is really pretty. That's beautiful. And here, look at that. I think she crocheted some of this stuff. I don't know. There's just so much of it. Look. More. This is from Hobby Lobby, I think, from their bridal department. I think this is a pretty color. Ooh, that's gorgeous. Beautiful. I'm loving that pink. Look at those. Oh, did you dye this? That's beautiful. Loving that. Girl, you outdid it. Did yourself. I'm so sorry about the package. Um, being at my neighbor's house. I'm just glad that... I'm glad that we have it. <laughs> you know? That it didn't get lost. Because this is a lot of stuff. Look how pretty. Oh my goodness, that's gorgeous. And I love these. I have several of these. Ooh, and this color is just beautiful. That's striking. And then some bling. And a key. Love the key. So pretty. And I think this probably fell out of this. I think. I think that's, yep. There we go. I'll get that glued back in there. Thank you so much, sweetie. That's like a ton of stuff. Oh, my goodness. Such pretty stuff, too. Okay, I'll just move this out of the way, and we'll put that together in a little bit. And I hope you have some information in here. Save those flowers. Oh. <laughs> this looks like Anna Griffin kind of stuff. Oh. And look at this. This is so pretty. Is this Anna Griffin? It looks like it. Oh, look at the cute little bird up here. And happy birthday and the beautiful butterfly. Love that butterfly. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. Okay. Uh, happy birthday, Ramona. You're so sweet. Thanks for all you do. 
So she has uh, XOXO, and her Facebook is Laura Taylor Haslauer. Am I saying that right? And then, um, oops, she has her email on here. I guess that's okay. It's Gmail, so you can figure that one out. And then um, her YouTube channel is Laura Loves to Craft. So, yeah, she'll have that on there. So beautiful, beautiful little flowers and stuff that she cut out. I think this is Anna Griffin. I swear I have this stuff from Anna Griffin. <laughs> These two, right? Am I right? Because I love Anna Griffin. It's like you can never have enough of Anna Griffin. And then she's got some little tags here. This is so pretty. I am loving this, girl. So, so, so pretty. That would make a beautiful card. You know it? Thank you so much, sweetie. Um, I will try to go ahead tomorrow. Um, I don't know how late I'm going to be up tonight filming, but I will try to remember tomorrow to send you an email to let you know that I did receive your um, package. Okay? Thanks, and we'll see you in the next one. Okay, everybody. I am coming to you with entry number 76, and this comes to us from Betsy in New Jersey. So I went in and took it out of the bag and all I see is a lot of stuff. Oh my goodness. I hope that she has a card with her last name on it in here. There's a lot of stuff in here, guys. <laughs> Oh, wow. I have bead caps and spring rings, filigree spring rings. Oh, wow. I've never seen anything like that before. That's cool. Oh, my goodness, girl. You gave me a lot of stuff. We have some beautiful bling there. We have some connectors, some filigree connectors. Oh, my goodness. The little butterfly charms. Cute. And then we have flower charms. Filigree flower charms. Wow. She must have some cool jewelry stores up there. Look at that. Oh, I love all this uh, industrial chic stuff that was from Michaels. I love this stuff. This stuff is really cool. Thank you so much. And then I have two different kinds of ribbon here. A lot of it. There's a lot of ribbon there. I have some um, skeleton leaves. And then some hearts and some stars. Lots of stuff. Goodness gracious. Wow, girl. Okay, let's see. I hope you have a, a card in here with some information on it. Look how she did this. For someone special. Says, Dear Ramona, happy birthday wishes. I hope you like the pocket letter. This is her second one that she's made. Your subbies made beautiful ones. Very amazing work. Enjoy all your goodies. Hugs, Betsy. So, okay. So, she's her girl. Hi, girl. I remember you now. Her Facebook's Betsy's Craft Bag. Her favorite color is blue. Her birthday's July 31st, 1962. Favorite snack, chocolate. Good one. Uh, her style is mostly anything in the, that she's in the mood for. She mostly posts on her work on Facebook, on YouTube, a few videos. Eventually, she will start posting more videos. But for now, it's just on Facebook. So, let's see what we have here. That's my parents' clock, guys, not mine. <laughs> I think we're ringing in at midnight right now, so we'll see how long this takes me tonight. I have a, several doilies. Oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. So she did 
a pocket letter book that goes this way. And look, and it's all Art Nouveau. Look at that. It's all Art Nouveau. Girl, where did you get all these cute little cards? So stinking cute. Okay, let's see what she's got here. She, she did these up so pretty. Look at this. Friends fight for you. And it says F. Uh, it's fight for you, respect you, include you, encourage you, need you, deserve you, and stand by you. How cute is that? Oh my goodness. Where did you get these cool cards from? Look. How sweet. Oh, Betsy, this is so cute. So very, very cute. Great job. Oh, my goodness. I can't believe you had all this Art Nouveau looking stuff. Very cool. Thank you so much for uh, joining the entry, girl. I really appreciate um, all the good feedback you always give me on everything. I really appreciate it. Guys, go jump over in, uh, to her Facebook channel and check her out. See you in the next one. Okay, guys, we are here with entry number 77. And this comes to us from Pat in Eureka, California. So she said she forgot to include the note uh, and a separate note um, and card will follow. So um, I haven't received it yet. So I'm guessing... Uh, this is probably it. So, let's see what we have here. So, she cut me out a bunch of cards so that I can make my own pocket letters or tins. And then some little bunny or a little teddy bear. Um, cute, cute, cute little buttons. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. And then, ooh, look how pretty. Oh, wow. Look at these. Oh, how pretty. So these are the little things that the charms that you put on to bracelets. You slide them onto bracelets. But oh, I love those. Those are really cute. And then I have a bunch of cool paper. Wow. This is really cool paper. This would be so pretty to cut leaves out with. Look at that. That would make such pretty leaves. And then dried flowers. Oh, they're botanical stickers. They're pressed and dried stickers encased in plastic. How cool is that? And then I have some little friendship bracelets. And then I'm seeing some kind of swans here. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at the swan material. <gasps> Look how cute. So stinking cute. Thank you so much, Pat. And then I have some lace. Very pretty. Oh, how cute. All right. I'm going to be able to open a store with all of this stuff pretty soon. Okay. So here comes the pocket letter. Oh, she did a lot of stamping. Wow. Look at all the stamping she did. And I'm not sure if this is the sorry yarn from Tuesday morning, but Tuesday morning did carry this. And this has got all birds. Look at all those. Oh, how pretty. Okay, so she did forget to put information in here. Oh my gosh. Where did you get this from, Pat? She included a coin. What? This is a real British one penny coin from 1921. Oh my goodness. Oh, wow. Okay, can you guys see that? Look how pretty. 
Oh, I will treasure that forever. I love coins. I will treasure this forever. Thank you so much. And then look what she did. She cut out every single one of these little swans and adhered them to the the um, little cutouts that she included in here for me. Oh my goodness. And then look how pretty she made that. And then I've got some really pretty sequins, some uh, blue jean tags, a really, really pretty dragonfly. She's got some letters and things in here. A beautiful leaf here. That's gorgeous. Some more bling here. And then some words that she cut out here. And guys, this takes a long time to cut all this stuff out. So I really do. I mean, I so appreciate you guys doing that. And I know it takes time. I'm, you know... Uh, yeah, so I really, really, really appreciate all the work that has gone into all of these. Thank you so much, Pat. Um, let me know if you have a YouTube channel or something, and I will go ahead and uh, enter your information um, for your, uh, like, down in the description box. Okay, guys, this was uh, entry number 77 from Pat, and I can't say her name. Uh, Sizalkas, am I saying that right? Um, yeah, it's challenging me big time tonight. So, <laughs> thank you so much, Pat. And this is amazing. Thank you so much. Talk to you later, guys. I'll be right back. Okay, everybody, I'm back with entry number 78 to my pocket letter challenge. And I'm already loving how this is all packed up so pretty. Um, I can't read the name on the package. Oh, how pretty. Look at this card. I'm not sure. Yes, it's an Anne and Griffin card. Okay. Oh, I hope she gave me some information on the inside about herself. It just says, uh, wishing you a day that blooms with happiness and then she gave me some cute little swan charms look how cute those are it's so stinking cute okay and look how she packed this up oh how pretty oh i don't want to mess it up she even put it put it like sealed it with beautiful washi tape that she has some information about herself in here someplace um, looking for a note I hope she included a note I hope I hope hmm I'm not seeing one not yet anyway cute she did that up though I'm still hoping okay so here are some tags from recollections um, at Michael's and look how cute these are that's so cute that will look so cute on the bottom of a tag I have some burlap here I have the same white or cream color trim and then it looks like she got me a bunch of cute stamps. Look how cool those are. These are like, it looks like some of them from the Olympics and Vietnam and uh, yeah, a lot from Vietnam. They're all from Vietnam, I think. Oh, cool. Love that. Oh. I'm trying to see her name. It almost looks like it's Charlene Wilcox. Charlene, it's, I'm not sure. 
Um, so she went ahead, she made a really pretty dangle here. This is really cute, that rose. And then she used a bunch of the relatives um, pictures from Tim Holtz that she stuck in some cute little envelopes. See how she stuck them in envelopes? And then she included some stamps. How cute. Oh, I hope there's a, a note in here. Oh, I don't see one. So I have some tea. Oh, here we go. Yay! <laughs> oh, and then I have some flags. I've got some beautiful doodads here and here. Look at these. What is this? Is this? That's beautiful. Look at it. It's ribbon, but it's like... It's got this opalescence to it that's really pretty. Okay, let's see what's her little note says. Look at her cute little flower there. Okay, let's see. Uh, her YouTube is uh, Cheryl's. It looks like Cheryl's Crafty World. Um, that's what it looks like, Cheryl's Crafty World. Um, she's been married. She's married. She has two kids. She lives in uh, Connecticut. Cre crea bleh, I cannot talk, guys. Oh, my God. Um, oh, my gosh. She is a stage three thyroid cancer survivor. Oh, my goodness. Oh, girl. Thank gosh. I mean, somebody was looking over you. It says, Ramona, I had fun making this for you. I hope you enjoy it. Blessings, Shirlene, I think it is. S-H-I-R-L-E-N-E, -E, I think. I think that's it. So thank you so much, sweetie, for entering. I am loving looking how every looking at how everybody um, kind of looks at vintage a different way. And I just love it. I mean, it's... <laughs> I love it. I can't say any more than that. It's just um, amazing to me that all of you took the time to do all this. This, is, Like I said, this has been a very difficult time for me um, in my life. This is probably the hardest time in my entire life that I'm going through right now with my parents and... <clears throat> not just them, but myself as well. So this is really doing nothing but picking me up and making me happy. And um, I thank you guys so much. I'll see you in the next one. Okay, everybody. This is entry number 79 to my birthday challenge. Um, let's see who this is from. I have a last name on the envelope but not a first name so let's see what we have here oh look how pretty look how pretty that is very pretty oh wow dear Ramona happy birthday blessings thanks for doing this challenge I have been making these items for you I hope you like them so her YouTube channel is creative moments with Dorinda and uh, her birthday is September 25th, 1964. That's my year two. Favorite colors, purple, styles, shabby, chic, vintage, and mixed media. She loves to learn new ways to express herself creative, uh, creatively. And she's a YouTube junkie. <laughs> I think we all are. Oh, my goodness. Where did you get this paper with the cherubs on it? Oh, my goodness. How pretty is that? Okay, let's see what we have here. Oh, she tied it up so pretty. You're good at making bows. I'm not. Okay. <gasps> oh, oh, this is from Scarlet Line. This is the planner from Planner Society. So there's that. Look how pretty. Oh, thank you so much. Let's see, I'll open this one first because I don't think this is the the uh, pocket letter. Oh, she made me some cherub um, tags. Wow. Ooh, ooh. I think 
Did you use, I think you used um, probably Mod Podge. That's It got a little sticky. So there's the first one. Oh my gosh. Look at that. You've got some pretty appliques that you used on these too. Look at that. I think I have one more, maybe. Maybe two. Oh my goodness. Two more. Okay, I'm trying to get the tissue off because it kind of got it got a little got a little tissue on there. Look how pretty. And this next one's going to be a challenge. Maybe. Yeah. There's two more. Good grief, girl, you went to town. Okay, I will... I don't know if I can stick that maybe in the refrigerator to get the, the tissue off. There we go. I'll be able to get that off later. It kind of... That happens with Mod Podge sometimes when it gets humid it will uh, make paper stick to it. Thank you so much for doing that for me, girl. Love it. Okay. Now, the bird is calling the dogs outside right now. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Ugh. Look at that. Oh, girl, this is so pretty. Look. I think I've used, I may have used this picture. I think I did use this in my pocket letter. And this one. This one's unusual, though. I love how you did the sides up with this peach, these peach bows. Wow, look at all this. Did you crochet these? How pretty. And these are so cute. I've never seen these before. Flat back pearls, and I have a beautiful applique right there. And she crocheted some work little things there. Look at that. So pretty, girl. Thank you so much, sweetie. Um, I will go ahead and enter you into the drawing. And uh, go check her um, YouTube channel out, guys. She's at Creative Moments with Dorinda. Okay? See you in the next one.